Okay, so cutting a little strip off the top of the fruit like that until you can see into the flesh. Don't go too deep or you'll spoil the shape. That's perfect. Okay, then I like to use a filleting knife and you're tracing your line just above the white line of the pit. And very importantly, as I said before, you're not just pushing your knife forwards, you're actually sawing your knife up and down. And that way it floats more easily or cuts more easily through the skin. There are navel oranges around at the moment, and so some of you will discover that tomorrow morning. They're the oranges which have the little navel or belly button in them, and they are highly cantankerous. So um, that's just life. Okay, so up and down, just watching where you're going all of the time. It doesn't matter if the rind, or the peel breaks. To squeeze any little bit of juice off that, if there is any, virtually nothing there, and continue on. You're after perfect little segments of orange with none of the membrane attached and with the pips removed. That's the object of the exercise. So we're going to sweeten the mixture with a little bit of orange and we're going to intensify the flavor with a very small amount of alcohol and um, the intensity of flavor will also come of course from the zest of some of the oranges and then we're going to set it with a little gelatine so it's just set. Um, these can be served on the day they are made. You want to allow a minimum of two hours really for them to set um, uh, but then they will keep perfectly in your fridge for several days. Just clean that up there. Okay, so having done that to segment, then cut on the near side or the inside of one of your um, sections and the near side of the opposite section. And you cut out a perfect segment. Now you can continue on like that rather extravagantly, but you don't have to. Go inside the skin of the next, uh, inside the next segment and then just carefully prize or encourage the segment to peel off completely cleanly. If you come across a pip, it's easier if you can extract it while, they, while the segment is still attached to the, uh, to, you know, to the larger part of the orange. If not, you just chase after it afterwards. So nice and carefully, just push out. Once you find the right place, it's kind of like jointing a chicken. When you find the right place, it works. And if you're not in the right place, it just doesn't work. So you kind of get a feel for it. Is that a, sec a pip? No, it's not. Like that. And this is all my oranges here, Pat. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Great. Roy. Yeah.